So, um, yeah, I, w I haven't done one of these in a while, and I sh it's not like I stopped making games. I was making Social Interaction Trainer, and I didn't want to talk about it because I just wanted to, you know, get it done and put it out. For that, I was working on, on the prototype for a, a detective game, which I'll be returning to soon, I hope. Well, I'm I'm excited for that one, and um, eventually I guess I'll get back to uh, to slash 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 of power lines at some point. I mean I forgot about that for months, but because uh, <laughs> I keep jumping from thing to thing. But yeah, I haven't been good about. Oh, I'm gonna make videos about stuff regularly, <laughs> but I don't. I don't because eh, I don't really have much to show. And and here I am. I've been working on. A sequel, basically, to Whip the Vote. In this game, it's uh, you're playing the, as the president. The reason I was willing to put the detective game sort of on ice, first, obviously, because of Social Interaction Trainer, but then not going straight back to it because, obviously, a new president. And uh should be a new House of Cards season in, like, a month or two. So I've been working on this, and um, you can't see much of what I've worked on. <laughs> You're seeing not much of nothing, really, right now. But um, there's, a, there's a lot of programming underneath the hood. I'm simulating stuff. I'm simulating all of Congress. I mean, Whip the Vote simulated, like, 50 people. And, and in this, you, because you're not necessarily directly going to be interacting with them all the time on everything, so I'm simulating them under the hood, like, all... 500 whatever representatives in Congress for the domestic part of the simulation. And then there's also your White House staff going to be a fair amount of simulation for a ton of different countries throughout the world. You're playing as the president, which doesn't explain much. There's a lot of games where you play as a president. I mean, it isn't a war game that I'm making. There's other games where you there will be war in it in some more simplified sense. This isn't necessarily a game about policy, like um, like the democracy games, but there is policy involved in the game. The reason I'm, I, I've dedicated so much time to simulating Congress because Congress are who control the laws, who control the budget. In a game like democracy, it makes you think um, that the president gets to control everything not really a true thing but you can nudge them in certain ways and and maybe if you grasp a bit more power you you can nudge them in more direct ways it's, it's kind of hard to explain but it should be cool once i get to where i want it to be unfortunately it feels like maybe it's just that i've done such little visually that i can't really tell how far i've gotten but it sure feels like i'm going slow